<laughs> I was like empathizing and sharing with you know these days, so I gotta run with less energy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I don't get the coffee that I require as an enthusiast. You know, some people drink it because they 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 can't be nice to people till they get some, or they can't get it done oh, until they yeah. get whatever their thing is. I just like the taste. We've got such great coffee around here. Yeah, we always love. We yeah. got access to amazing craft coffee. And I find that it's like, you know, it's almost like if you were a wine enthusiast, you know, you can enjoy enough of it, you end up. <laughs> hey, Justin. So um, I'm going to do another uh, another pour. As soon as I get this tape, <laughs> I, got it. I just got it. Uh, so we're going to. I'm going to do a little bit different technique of the first coffee table. I wonder if we could use just a little stretch of that tape to cover up that little area with the, of the seam with those holes. Yeah, which is right here. Oh, great minds. <laughs> So, actually, I did that by accident. <laughs> so, but thank you for making me look so nice. <laughs> oh, Lord. Great idea. Yeah. I think we're... Yeah. So, what... The different technique that I'm going to do... On, uh, let's see, we got four people watching. I didn't realize we were making a video, by the way. Yeah. Hey, your stuff, no. <laughs> this is my friend Brandon Bradle. You never know when the cameras are rolling around here. I know. They're, <laughs> and they're going to roll more. <laughs> yeah, you better, why don't you uh, scope out the work? Make yeah. sure that. Uh, we're not gonna kill ourselves. Waste a lot of epoxy. But uh, let's see. I'm reading your thing, Justin. Hang Got on. Another one right here. Okay. Yeah. So. Yeah. 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 Um, actually, that marks, but uh, yeah. here's some. Got the tape. Just, yes, yeah, handle it. So, we're making sure that our, our mold does not leak because if uh, you know how. Leaks are expensive. Leaks are. Oh. <laughs> Boy, howdy. Yeah, it's a valuable, oh. valuable um, material on the floor. Yeah, slide that maple. I'm going to start mixing. Yeah. Yeah, where's our bucket? Do we have that big bucket? Uh, I haven't seen it in here. I'll find the big bucket. So you guys ask any question you want. We'll make stuff up till Greg gets back. <laughs> eh? You better start singing the song or something. That's right. I'm glad we, I am glad we gave this a, a look-see, though. Yeah, yeah. That's the thing with this, this one, this tape, the packaging tape. That yeah. We're concerned that it might not hold as long.
and putting it down uh, yeah. the lower part. See how there's a bunch of looks like a scrape right there almost? Yeah. We're almost to where it looks like we should have another bead or something. I don't think I have any quick drying. Yeah. And that is a big one. A big yeah. Yeah. And we might get lucky and have it. I think every, the game looks pretty tight outside. So you guys, you don't need me anymore because uh, you've already stole the show, right? <laughs> Either that or, yeah, we dropped off. There's nobody watching. Talking to us, right? Made too clean of a cut on that last one. So, one thing that... One thing that I have learned is never mix your epoxy on your project. Did you end up filling some on one? Yeah. It's only a matter of time. Yes. So. So we have a V mix. Yeah, that A is so thick, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can sit there for a long time for it to come out. So we're getting ready to uh, pour. I want to try and get an eighth of an inch pour across the whole face of it, uh, which is the bottom end is going to be the top end, if that makes sense. The bottom of this is will be the table surface. Yes. Better way of putting it. <laughs> Bottoms up. Bottoms up. <laughs> Bottoms up. That's a good one. All right. <laughs> All right. Yeah, ask any question while you leave. <laughs> while I leave. Can you put the A in warm water before helping it flow better? Yes, of course. I've even seen people put it under a torch. And... Uh, and it uh, makes it um, a lot, no. a lot gooder. There's a little one right there. I'd like your English. Yeah, you <laughs> like That's, That's part of your brand. <laughs> Being a regular dude who says regular stuff like regular people. <laughs> and do we want to cut this whole thing? Yes, you don't want any of that. Uh, oh, this one's hot. I mean, this one's uh, very, very molassesy in winter. Hey, Angie. Um, changing gears here from the auction to production. Because somehow I got to pay the bills around here. So what we're doing is, uh, this is a uh, number two Dutch bro table. And uh, we're gonna change up the technique because every time we do it, we learn one thing or a couple of things and 
figure out how to be more efficient at what we're doing. Because the name of the game for businesses is efficiency. And productivity, which is basically the same thing. And again, smooth is slow. Slow is smooth and smooth is fast. That move goes. I gotta I actually have to slow down my brain to actually unpack what you just said. Is <laughs> before <laughs> I didn't know people have been saying that for a long time. <laughs> yeah, there's, so there's a little piece here. Man. Oh, is that what you're doing now? Last right there. That's the one. Oh, yeah. Are we down here? Good. Yeah. Just right here? Yeah. If, if you just, uh, it's just, give me a little bit because I can push it down. It's kind of crazy. Uh, get into that tight corner. I'm going to call. Jesse, okay. Okay. So here we are mixing one gallon. So back to that not pouring on the project. Yeah, I know. Did that. you bump it or did the cup leak? No, it's just like you have a dribble here and you take it off and then it dribbles on here. Yeah. Now it's it's wipeable right now, but when it hits when you the beans. Yeah. Yes. yes. Gonna yep. be right there. Okay, okay. Be awesome. Yes, by the time I got <laughs> all eight of them done, I will actually know what I'm doing. No. <laughs> by the time we have eight done, we'll have 16 new ideas <laughs> and discover <laughs> eight more ways to do it wrong. Or we'll have eight prototypes. Eight yeah. prototypes. <laughs> yes, there you go. And then they'll put it in the big order. We live in the world of prototypes. <laughs> okay, I gotta go get some gloves. Cause I don't wanna get stick fied. How many per? I got I got a few. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is you're up. That's you're, us then. You're ready to sing. Let's we'll see, we got any questions coming in there? How can from this far? She retracted the message. Okay. Saw Greg leaving. Testing. So I'm just gonna check the measurements here. I don't want everybody's. We did a couple of mixes on that, and I don't know if it was because it didn't get stirred mm -hmm. properly or or thoroughly. Uh, but man, we had some of it reacting, too, which is why I think it didn't oh, get stirred yeah. properly. We had a couple react where some parts of it were starting to set up earlier. Hotter than others. Yeah, like the mix was. Yeah, like we just. Yeah. It was a like one that we did by hand. You know, I gotta get I my Superman's cape on. Get yeah, it all I done. We're just refreshing on why you should mix thoroughly, and I didn't mean to interrupt the advertisement. No, 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 that's <laughs> okay. Oh, these are like, these are like mitts. They're. Yeah. Oh, they don't have the fingers. Oh, okay. They, <laughs> they're gonna be really good if they got the. Oh, hang on, that's a, that's a left. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like uh, what's that stretchy woman? Uh, Expand yeah. expandables? Like, yeah, the yeah those. Oh, from Incredible. Uh, Incredibles. The Incredibles. Incredibles. Yeah, there you go. Stretchy. We all had little kids at some point. <laughs> little grandkids. All right, cool, cool. I like actually. I like these gloves because yeah. usually. Come through they the they got them on all the way and they uh, tear the band, so it's a yeah, good that's start. Yeah, that's some of the other ones. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Long sleeves. Nine mils. Yeah, you start getting raisins on the sleeves. All right. So, you want to pour that, and I can... Uh, this is like... I bet you can turn it upside down like a thick milkshake. And yeah. Let's we'll see about six minutes we'll get the first drop of... Are we ready for real? We're ready. Okay. <laughs> yeah, and and I if this, we're not, we'll figure it out later. That's one of my favorite things about hanging out with you. <laughs> we're, we're both professional audible callers. <laughs> I'm guessing that the number of ideas going on in your brain and the number of ideas going on in my brain, against our will, 
Yeah. So as much as I'd love to focus on this, <laughs> but I, I do bring the average down. We're going to move into the camera. All right. You know what? They hear all these lips flapping, but yeah. they don't see them. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. You need to order me a shirt soon. Yes, you do. That would be awesome. We, we got this. Yeah, if you could. Um, yeah, this is like the molasses stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm heading to Las Vegas next week, and we may have to reorder after Las Vegas show. And then in two weeks, we're going to go do another Las Vegas show. See you there. Yeah. You're going to be at the summit? I'm going to be at hopefully both. Definitely awesome. next week. Next year, you're going to be one of the speakers. Oh, you don't want that. Sure. I'll stand right beside you. Okay. That'll <laughs> work. Yeah, this is I big know. big as I've ever seen it. Yeah, it was on the floor, so it's... Oh, oh you guys, you guys can give me a grin here. Yeah. A grin? Yeah. A chagrin. <laughs> a chagrin. <laughs> All right. I think that's probably... That's as good as we're going to get. as much as going to come out. Yeah, it's wonderful. All right, so... Okay. I want to do something with this before I just set it down without mm -hmm. looking. Okay, here we go with the... Whew. Now, this is actually a good shot. In here. Oh, right in there? Oh, yeah. Just don't drop the camera in it. will let it come out. <laughs> you, you, just a still shot of Ooh, it. Video. 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 Okay. Well. She said across it all, eh? Yeah. I don't, yeah, I don't think so. Because that's, what, about three-eighths of an inch thick. Mm -hmm. And 
and it's got probably most of the territory. Probably covering a, no. No, I know it, it. It needs to reach most of the territory. <laughs> got about a sixth of it covered. You think? We, it's actually we, leveled. The whole thing is yeah, already. This is actually level both ways. Yeah. yeah. Depending upon if the level is actually a level. <laughs> it's all relative to the level. All right. Maybe it would be a fun video to do uh, calibrating a level. I don't know if many people have seen that. I agree. There you go. That would be awesome. Well, we'll first have to figure out how you do that. <laughs> we well, might not do that. <laughs> We'll call in the expert, right? So, no. Yeah. <laughs> Metrology, the study of measurement. There you go. Oh, yeah, it's very critical, right? Yeah, I knew that word, metrology. <laughs> <laughs> I must have learned it from you, no? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's that's a big thing for you. There we go. You'll be qualified. Calibrating stuff. A lot, yeah, a lot of it. You got to decide what you're going to measure and why. Thinking about yeah. you know five years from now, how would things change, uh -huh. and how would you have to adapt the least, hopefully, based yeah. on any projected change about how you what you would measure. How? So I say two gallons. That's your guess. That's my right. guess. Two gallons more? No, total. Yeah. So this is one, right? Mm -hmm. that, that we have in here. So, and I imagine it's still, oh yeah, it's self well Yeah, it's about a quarter of a, yeah. Okay. Because the radius would be bigger. And, and what, what's <laughs> the dry, is this the, like this, the many hours dry time? Yeah, tomorrow, tomorrow we'll be able to, uh, mess with it. What are you looking for, Greg? Yeah. yeah, I remember learning about compounding error, not myself. Hey, Josie. Can you guys slide right now? Yeah. Okay. yeah. All, right. All the more reason to join. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody <laughs> told me either. Oh, <laughs> um, we, we had an eight-foot satellite dish that we had to put the other lighting. You had to put a little dot every one inch. Mm -hmm. And one guy took made a one-inch yeah. or a two-inch stick, and he was going like this. By the time he got across... Those things were way off because you know you're a little off. It's not exact. So you always start from one end. Go. <laughs> you learn the hard way. You got to rub all that off and compound error. Yeah. Not unlike compound interest. <laughs> it either adds up faster. <laughs> yeah. Well, if the bank's getting it, yeah, it's very charging you. Know? <laughs> I'm gonna get some foxy in my mouth. Oh boy. And they'll save you on dental work. You know, um, we got all the tools here to file it back straight. We do, we do, we do. New meaning to long in the tooth. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I did get a little bit in my mouth. Do you really? It tastes like a little bit. No, I put a... Uh, <laughs> It's there. It's, it's I, have, it's, I have one up here. It has dissipated rice. You could ask Mike, and then if they could put a bit well, of mint flavoring in it, we're going to eat it. All right. There is a half gallon of B, and then we're going to put a half gallon of A. You want to get the thick stuff again? I'll get her. Transfer in any debris, it'll end up at the top of the table. Uh, yeah, we don't want that. Well, if it ends up the, at the top top, it's going to be sanded. So hopefully it ends up at the top or top. Or we can't have any floaters. No floaters. Yeah. And this has to be level. And we have to be careful torching it. Yeah. Oops. All the way to the top red line. And it's not going to pour, it's going to squeeze. Let me grab it. Yeah, it's uh, it's like molasses in winter. Mm-hmm. It does. <laughs> yes, it is. Let's see. Greg, just message to you on Facebook, Greg. Mm -hmm. 
you can read that? Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Um, I don't have a, uh, I mean, I can definitely deliver it to him, but I don't, uh, I'm, uh, I don't uh, know if Leo ever had a, a page on Facebook, but yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, you know, another thing too is those GoFundMe's, man. It's amazing what some people have raised money for. Oh, I know. I'm out of work. <laughs> no, no, I don't want to go to work. <laughs> Still got an iPhone, Wi Fi, yeah. internet connection. Yeah. Uh, this wall, Marty, on the phone, on, on the uh, form, I just uh, purchased landscape edging. It's six inches and it's probably about three sixteenths thick. So, uh, but I do have uh, tape on it, and there we are. I'm a tape you <laughs> with thine own eye. Mm -hmm. How much extra might be required from the residual? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one flows in slow motion. <laughs> this is taffy taffy. That's good to it. Like the old migrating moles joke. I I actually. Papa mole and a mama mole and a baby mole. Uh huh. And what they do? They had to move construction site. You know, there's a new building going up. The <laughs> daddy mole went first, and the mama mole went second. Baby mole went last through the hole. Ended up getting to the other side, and the dad thought maybe they were at a waffle house because his nose got to the end of the hole first, and he said. Smells like sugar. The mama's nose got there and she said, no. Nah. Smells like syrup. And then the last in line baby mole said, no, nah, I don't even need to sniff. It smells like molasses around here. <laughs> and it's clean. See, family friendly. <laughs> this joke's about molasses, right? <laughs> Also timely. I like the last. <laughs> All right. Um, that rag is are, around here somewhere. Man. But you're less uh, than, than I am. I mean, oh, dude. I'm I got, sorry. That, that, there's <laughs> a degree. We're going to be regretful, though. I'll chase it down. Before you wait. Good call. Oh, 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 how, how did we get that in there? It's up on the it happens. All right. Here's the guys. Woo! Oh. All right. How heavy was the last table you just completed? Actually, it's not complete, but it's under a hundred pounds. Um. Turn oh, the other one right there. Oh, that's like right there. Kind of a big one there. It's right in the Duber place. If I find another one, I'm just kidding. Yeah, we don't have to worry about it. It'll be camouflaged with beans. It does match the beans. It does match the beans. Um, the, we, we kind of messed up the first one. Uh, but this process is going to be way better than the other process. The other, the first one that we did is still salvageable. So I'm going to get two really nice ones done. And then we're going to fix the, the first one. Uh, because we're under a time crunch for getting, uh, for getting these done. So, gotta happen, gotta happen. Three or more mixes. Three, uh, two to three more mixes. You need. Oh, you mean to cover this whole area? We'll see. I hope not. It's creeping faster than we thought. There you go if that sneaks up on me. I will. It's like the tide is coming in. <laughs> so Never turn your back on the seat. No, 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 no. Or port boxes. 
gallon count, I believe we're probably going to end up with about 12 gallons of epoxy. Uh, the first one is really hard to figure out. Um, the last video that we did like this, we were at eight and a half or nine and a half gallons. Eight and a half gallons of epoxy. So, because I'm a little hot. Oh, did you lower it? Lower the thing, or is it just the battery that's... Yeah. They said they have a lot of you to do it? Yeah, we did that battery. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna pour a uh, hopefully an eighth inch thick layer, let it harden, then do the uh, the bean patty, the, co the coffee patty. <laughs> so, um, but once we get the coffee patty all hardened, that's with the center uh, foam and the beans on top, uh, and that hardens. Then we have one more major pour, which that's where all of the epoxy is going to be poured out. Then we puff it out of the mold and do a uh, sand it down and do a flat coat and be done. I don't want to drop it with one hand either. Let's see. Yeah, the, the button's in the front. That's why. <laughs> So yeah, you guys can do this with rocks, sand, mud, dirt, twigs, pine cones. pine cones. Somebody's gonna do it with uh, like some special occasion roses on their 25th wedding anniversary or something. Dry them out or maybe not dry them out. Just pass them in place. Yeah, cool. Cool, Justin. We can talk about that. I'd rather uh, talk about that, um, first of all, face to face, but second of all, second best is on the phone. And down at the last bottom is Facebook, YouTube, and texting. But yeah, that would be awesome. You think we might be there? We're there. I kind of, I kind of think that I get her started. Like, yeah, if I, if I start spinning around the, the bucket, just stop. You got her. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna pour it on that side. I'm going that way. He's going that way. See, the last thing you want to do is torch this. Then you heat it up and... And then, the, and then it heats the tape, mm -hmm. like it did on the side? Yeah. That's, um, hmm. That's a little scary there. Um, actually, if I could get... A scraper? A scraper, I could scrape this bucket out. Then we can... Thank you, sir. My pleasure. And uh oh, uh oh, no. ah, that was false alarm. The old uh, it's, it's it's an old, that's an old leak. It's not tuning yet. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to kid me? No, 
Is that mold? No, my so brain is mold. joke. My brain is stuck on observe the leaks all the time. That's like the golden rule of life these days. Yeah, it is. Your latest nightmare. Like, yeah, I'm about to. I'm about right. to go to bed, and I'm wondering if my garage floor is about to get an inch higher tonight. <laughs> and well fortified. Uh huh. Oh, there's a nice one. Let me grab it. Like a lifeguard, I am. Mm -hmm. All right, so here we go. We're gonna get it around to the edge. Do you see that? I, I took it back out of that pile. And I'm just gonna keep on using it. it. Greg uses it at least. There it is. So this will be it, do you think? Mm -hmm. uh, we might need one more deal. See, this is, we're doing the flat coat reverse. <laughs> the final coat first. But eventually, you will sand that top and flood coat over it, right? Right. <clears throat> but this is the way someone who has dyslexia thinks. <laughs> You know anybody like that? <laughs> Just a few. You can need to put that other battery back on the charger. Yeah, yeah, I've done it already. Oh, okay. it's this. Man, I tell you, Dropbox takes forever to download. I think I'm trying to download all that part. Dropbox? Yeah. Is that like something? Yeah, it's a share folder online sort of thing. Oh, to get all the stuff from um, that you already had. Yeah, we're we're dropping Dropbox. <laughs> I don't doubt that. This is a pretty neat idea, by the way. See what you did there, and I like it. <laughs> it's, it's just the ones that's so sticky. Yeah, it's not. It's not the things. A little bit. Can you just open up work area? Mm -hmm. Thank you, man. Oh, I yeah. And I'm not surprised about that. We think pretty similarly. I think if an eighth inch across is your goal, you I think you might be there. Yeah. Well, we got 45 minutes to make it happen. There's, there's enough. Um, surface tension to hold an eighth inch up from flowing. However. Ooh, I think so. So. Keep an eye on this and make sure that levels out. Not at will with the torch. I'm just deathly afraid of the torch. A unique spot right there. A unique spot. So how do you catch a unique rabbit? Unique up on it. <laughs> <laughs> There's one for you. It's against. been a long day, right? <laughs> <laughs> They're going to rename your show. <laughs> These are some high quality humor coming out. This is the best of the best. And it's live. That's the scary part. I thought of a really good joke and I shared it and then I forgot. It was really good. <laughs> Seriously. I was impressed with myself. It doesn't happen too often. That's because you don't have time to look backwards and think how yourself was. Mm -hmm. We're too busy thinking about next. Yes, next, what next? What next? Yeah, right there. It'll it'll go. Think so? Well we'll watch it. Okay. So if not, the torch will the torch will reduce that surface tension. Yeah. 
Yeah, but it's so sad. But yeah, it's, it's already it's already starting to equalize. No, that's good. Well, yeah, right there. Actually, so not. Yeah, right here. You can see it. The light is right down to the Tyvek tape right here. in the perfect spot mm -hmm. to just make you laugh and see everywhere. Yeah. It's a nice shirt. You sure you want epoxy? That's what... Well, I didn't know I was going to be epoxy when I came over, but you know how I am. I only got... My clothes could be worn once or maybe twice. So Brandon shows up this morning and says, I want to look at some slabs, but he doesn't... He, he totally <laughs> forgot that out back is like six inches of mud. <laughs> and he's got these really nice Nike tennis shoes on. <laughs> and so here I am plowing a road for him in the mud so that he doesn't sink so far. That was kind. <laughs> However unnecessary in the future. Using up clothes is something I just do. Yeah. Me you made your peace with it. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I shop at uh, secondhand store. <laughs> Bingo. They also got good. They also got good. Good vibe with them. Is somebody tried this out and didn't wreck it? Mm -hmm. I've gone. I've gone one for one. On yeah, I try out a brand new pair of pants, and uh, they don't make it to a second time. Yeah. If I start with ones that have already been through the break, and better luck. I agree. These ones um, got it. The proven history of making it to another round. Okay, I need that rag so that I can start the torch, but I'm gonna get not a glue off. the torch. I'm, I'm. You're good. I'm good. If you want me to get it started. Okay. Yes, please. I didn't see it. Uh, it's here. Right there. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's up. That's a 
Can we scrape a little bit out of the bucket and put it in the, there's two yes. spots. We got a little bit of fire going on. I hope my insurance company is not watching this. <laughs> okay, so this was a bucket. Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's it. And you probably need about two healthy drops. Where are we thinking? Over there on that All side. Oh, right, right, right. Right here? Probably. All right. Hmm. Oh, I see it now. Right here. Okay, so two tight exit. We're going to get more than that. Okay. Well. Luckily, that'll be all right. More is okay. What? What's that bottom? Yeah, that piece hanging on the bottom there. Yeah. <laughs> Let's grab that before right. we have regret. I'm liking it. I better torch that. Any other spots? I think that's it. I think we're like. Yeah. Uh, uh. Feeling my word. Okay. Is, this, is this a trick of the light right here? I can only see it. No, it's good. The bubbles over here. Yeah, some of it. Yeah, watch out because I've been known to get people with a paddle going out to fish because I forget the people are there going out to the fish. Light them up! What? Yeah, I guess, guess the moment the breeze must have already managed it. Not here, so Oh, good. And there's another little piece right against the fence. Oh, that's a big piece. So we are. Dog, still not we are um, putting it about 80 degrees inside of here so it pops quickly. The quicker it pops, uh, the more safe you are of getting hair and floaties in there. So, um, I think this came from the bottom of that pail. Mm -hmm. That's what I think. So note to, so note to selves, mm -hmm. don't put the pail on the ground in between. Of course. Uh, oh. it's okay. Nope. Never mind. That was something different. <laughs> you are just dramatic. You're, like, you're, you're like, too dramatic for me, man. Yeah. <laughs> All that energy. Oh. It's displacing itself. Actually, it works well for the camera. Because <laughs> actually, for the show, you know, when we were in my backyard and they just wanted to record us going, whoa, 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 whoa! And, and then they put it in certain places in the in the show. Yeah. No, 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 stop, stop, stop! <laughs> so you were just doing that. They invite Early. your homie over there, jumps and everything. <laughs> Is that, a, is that an air bubble right down to the Oh, yeah. There's going to be some air bubbles. Or is that just a... Oh, I don't know. It looks like it goes to the surface. Like so we torch it three times. Three times. And I torch it one and a half. I don't want to, I don't want to touch it. Yeah. I think it, it looks to me it's like it was be underneath the surface. It's like some sort of inclusion. Oh. That I don't know which wasn't included. Greg's willing to touch it. I got to. Oh, that's yeah. because it's, it's a piece of... Uh, it's hot glue. It's hot glue. Uh, hot glue. Gotta get it off. Yeah. Good eye. Where's that uh, the tongue of your side? That might scrape it. Yeah. They're around the corner. No. Around the corner, so around the table. Yeah. Yeah, yeah just that way. Right. Here, back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I want to get the actual. Tongue depress is a good idea because you run really reduce mm -hmm. the risk of any damage on that Tyvek tape. So if the wind goes that way, it hit that way. This way? Yeah. There's a little piece of it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is there more? I don't know. Is there more? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's got to go. You got to scrape it that way. We have two people holdouts, two holdouts. 
Let me see here. There we go. Look at that big white spot right in the center of our table. Okay. Now that what are we going to do about that? That was good. I got it on my tongue. Let me dig it in. Is there any more? Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah, that's the problem with that. Okay, you got it. Tripping mm -hmm. around. Be really, really be careful. Outside of another, some hitting some of these smaller air bubbles, I don't see any more mm -hmm. debris. Oh, it's awesome sauce. So the good thing, even if nobody's watching live, it's it's to record it, you know, mm -hmm. just for record in case we come across another process, process, processes. Or so processes. just just to give you guys an idea, we have about thirty dollars of Tyvek tape right here, twenty five dollars, twenty six dollars for the. Um, landscape edging, two sheets of three quarter inch MDF, which is twenty one bucks a piece. So just in the mold, we got a few dollars. Then we have two gallons, which is one hundred and ninety dollars of stone coat epoxy, and we haven't even really started yet. <laughs> It's like race cars, this hobby. <laughs> if, you, if you got all sorts of time and you love lighting money on fire and, and you don't just want to put it in a bag and light it on fire and throw it out the window of your car or something, mm -hmm. this, is a great, this is a great way to have fun doing it. But you get a lot more use out of it later oh, on. <laughs> it, this is, it's addicting, though. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Doing this thing. This is like golfing, the rich man's sport. Yeah. This is, this is good. These are amazing. <laughs> what are we doing here? <laughs> These are amazing tables. Though. I mean, they will be. Mm -hmm. You know, that's the thing is that it's it's a long. So, session. so the really cool thing is, is tomorrow after this is uh, cured, I'm going to take a sharpie and I'm going to set it at a half inch and make a half inch mark all the way around the rim. That way, that's going to be my first bean lay layer. Then I'm going to put the um, styrofoam inlay then we're going to put more beans around the edges and on the top and that'll be our bean cookie but before we do any of that we've got to sand this to 220 so that it has a place to stick sand it and clean it sand it and clean it <laughs> yes 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 but right now we have a really good advertisement for Tyvek. yeah we do as uh, Andres was saying, <laughs> I have been really continuously surprised how what this looks like after you you sand down to two twenty and then mm -hmm. you reapply another top coat, flood coat, mm -hmm. bean cookie coat, whatever, <laughs> and it comes out like a ten thousand grit polish. Yeah, <laughs> yes, it is. It's cool. <clears throat> so. Where do we get coffee beans from, says David Curry? I am working on that right now. Uh, I'm talking to Dutch bros to see if I can't take all of their bad beans and sell them as craft supplies. So um, stay tuned. It'll be on our website, organbrawls.com. Or if you want to go to our other website, which is just no... Uh, TheBurlHunter.com, which brings you to OregonBurls.com. Or GotBurl.com brings you to OregonBurls.com. Which brings you Or <laughs> TheBurlStore.com brings you to OregonBurls.com. Or BurlStore brings you to the OregonBurls.com. <laughs> or you can just contact us on Facebook. So, so Marty asks, what, what is the star of the inlay? Is it a space filler? Yes, it is a space filler because if this was all epoxy and all beans, you'd probably have 50 about gallons in here. Yeah, you'd have a lot of gallons of epoxy, a lot of gallons of beans, and crazy heavy. I mean, dangerous heavy. Yeah, I bet fifty gallons is about the about the number that you that you displace by using that foam inlay. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So the beans don't take up that much room. No, they I mean, don't. They're really, they're yeah. They're just ways to create air pockets to fill with. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it holds in the. Uh, <coughs> it is just an encased uh, foam. 
Uh, so we can just encase the foam with epoxy and we try to minimize how much epoxy, but still have um, a sturdy table, something that is structural to where if it falls, it won't break or, or something to drill into. Uh, so that's uh, that, that took a little bit of planning, a little bit of trial and error, but we have it down. Now we just need to tweak it to have it down there. Downer. downer. More, more downer. More a little down. more downer. A little <laughs> bit time. more downer. <laughs> he is downer. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, anyways, stay tuned for the next time. Uh, every time we do a stage on this, we're going to go live and record it and get. Uh, so you can ask your questions. And right now, David, you said, is it heavy? <laughs> When we are done with the foam core, it's going to be about 100 pounds. Um, without, it would probably be about 300 pounds. If this was without the foam core, this, this would be for, forklift only. Yeah. yeah, yeah, super dangerous. We wouldn't get out of the room. That would be the problem. Yeah. <laughs> one, leg cramp, one leg cramp and it's so, all over. <laughs> I'm going to torch it one more time and then kick everybody out of the office. So, Andres, good thing that you have a laptop. <laughs> I think it's about time to get kicked out of here. It's getting mighty hot. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I didn't dress for the Bermuda atmosphere. Yeah. yeah it, it's, I'm going gonna, gonna to pull this off and see if I can't get a, a quick video of, like, right in this light. Okay. How, how quick. I'll, how smooth yeah. that just wipes out the bubbles. No, we had quite a bit of really? that the other day with the oh, yeah. I'll come around here with your inside. When you did mine? No, no, the uh oh. that Cody Ridley. That countertop? Yeah. Yeah, you've got the little micro bubbles and then you've got the larger bubbles. Boom. Oh, we've got hair here. Oh, I've got a little bit of... Oh, cool. I got it. I just worked out. But I don't know if it's... All right. Uh, four days. This is a, a four-day process. This is air bubble. Yeah. Um, we we've, we've really cut it down. Uh, if I didn't do this step right here, it would be a three-day process. But this takes one day. Well, if for somebody without the right equipment, oh yeah, a lot, you know, pulling off some of these circle jigs would be tricky. Yeah. So let me brag a little bit about uh, Brandon. No, um, don't do that. No, 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 no. This is good. This is good. So I sketch on a napkin uh, a circle jig. That I that I want. We're talking on the phone, and I'm sketching, and then I take a picture of it, and I text it to him. The next morning, by twelve o'clock, I have a working prototype. That's how awesome this guy is, and uh, that's how much fun we have. <laughs> yeah, that's how much fun we have, and so uh, and. So he's he's the manufacturer of them, and we uh, we already have an order for a hundred and twenty of these things. That's right. Um, so if you haven't seen the circle jig, go to organgirls.com, or okay, go through the whole <laughs> list. <laughs> nah, um, they can replay it. Yeah, they can we'll, replay it. We'll put we'll put the time in the comments. Yeah, there you go. Uh, OregonBurls.com or TheBurlHunter.com or GutBurls.com. Uh, we have a lot of 
a lot of domains that go to OregonBurls.com. And the, the tool is lifetime warranty. Uh, and we can do up to, right now, you can do up to uh, 48 inch diameter circles. Oh, yeah, I see that. And something. And that's a bubble. A bubble. I can, tap, I can do it one more time, but we'll wait. Um, so uh, they are $93. For a lifetime warranty, not guaranteed not to break. If it if it does, we will send it to you. Even pay the shipping. You don't. You just have to tell us. Actually, text me a picture of it if it breaks, and I'll ship you out a new one. Um, please don't roll over it with a dozer. Uh, maybe it, the smaller dozer would probably be okay at D eight. Probably not. Um, so. Thanks, Dave. Um, yeah, OregonBurls.com. You can order them right now. Uh, uh, Stone Coat Countertops is going to also distribute uh, these for us. And um, the Naughty Artisan in Las Vegas is going to be uh, selling these for us. So uh, either of those websites will work for you. I don't know if they have them up on their website yet, but on YouTube, you can go and watch this thing in action. Uh, not only that, just this morning, it uh, we used we used it on cutting the semicircle for uh, the foam, the styrofoam. Uh, we we used it. Uh, we have a, a cutting tool, uh, a heat gun cutting tool that cuts specifically styrofoam, and it fit perfectly in the jig. Uh, works wonderful for any kind of circles. So your router mounts to it, and you can go up to 48 inch diameter circles. <laughs> Sign yours. Um, I'll have to get a special pen because it's black, so a regular Sharpie won't work. I'd be glad to. Um, actually the whole crew, we, we do, uh, we're we do autographs, but, uh, not because we're special cause you can only because you guys asked for it. <laughs> oh yeah. 48 inches. That's a good size table. The rest of it's laying down. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, see, the, the, the cool thing is, is this is going to be a quarter inch route, a route part. So, but there was a anything. Last, this one was about mm, further in, huh? About yeah. an inch and a quarter in. Yeah. It would have gone in. You bet, David. I'd be glad to. It looks like on a funky edge of the Tyvek tape. Mm -hmm. Some adhesive got underneath. Oh, it. It was yeah. Hopping in the wind. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. yeah. You're asking me? Yeah. Dude. I'm gonna sweat. <laughs> oh, we have paper towels right here. No. Right in. Actually, yes. Yeah, so I'm gonna get this quick before it's on my forever. Oh, we still got a good 15 minutes before it pops. All right, I am going to I've forgotten about things a lot more important than that for a lot longer. <laughs> Cool, cool, cool. Um, we're going to torch this one more time, then we're going to say goodbye. Because we've been on for a whole hour. We've been in here for an hour. Yeah. Yeah, it goes quick. <laughs> but all this moving around, I'm seeing little dust bunnies. Bad the the hair that floats in there won't just burn up and nothing when you pour it in. But if it's dark hair, you might not see it against the uh, beans. But you will, because it's a care for it. Beautiful, beautiful. It is. You almost got them all right here. <laughs> Add a little bit of heat. Oh, shoot. Oh! <laughs> Got 
That's okay. <laughs> Just got up the it really is amazing how much a little bit of heat just lets this stuff flow. Oh, yeah. Did you see something? Yeah. No. I was going to give you this in case you needed to wipe off the end of that. Oh, it's burned out. Off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How did that how did that lay down on there? That, that yeah, that's good. Yeah, I'm looking at glass for you guys. A little bit here. Oh, I see it. Boom. A little bit here. I think we're there. We're done. We're done. So, so we'll probably end up hitting. Um, no, not that much, David, on our inlay for the foam. If that's what you're talking about, it's we actually leave one inch all the way around, so it's two inches shy of seventy-two. So we cut it at seventy-inch diameter. Um, 35 inch radius and that seems to work out fantabulous so, which if you're calibrating is a little bit more better than slightly better yes <laughs> it is so um, I'm gonna close with my wonderful joke of how to catch a polar bear so, for all you people who live in the great north, you guys will say this again, really. But for all you who are like below polar bear stage um, or area, uh, the way that you cut a, a catch a polar bear is you go and cut a hole using our circle jig. I like that. <laughs> in the ice. Then you get a can of peas and you put some peas around the hole. Then after that, step back and when a polar bear comes to take a pea, you kick him in the ice hole. But a boom. That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> That's like four. That the winner is already <laughs> That was along the same thing as the moles. <laughs> Unless somebody was counting better, more, more wetter and more accurate than us. I think that was four. Four winners. Yeah, yeah. I, I would actually, t I would actually tell that joke when I'm preaching in front of my church. I don't know if they would keep me, but I would definitely tell them. They'll bring you back. So my, <laughs> my glasses got epoxy all over them from oh. months and months ago. Nice. Does that is somebody get? I think we getting LOLs there. You're getting yeah, that's just yeah, <laughs> yeah. And they, you got. <laughs> You got some teachers too. T E J A S. What does that mean? I have is that a, a typo for Texas? <laughs> oh, it could be. Yeah, it could be. It could be. All right, you guys. Bless you. God bless you. I love you so much. Thanks for uh, joining us. See you tomorrow. Yeah, we will. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Seriously.